Hello my lovely roses and welcome to Queen Base Hive where I give you sweet sunny videos and today I will be showing you everything that came with the Pokemon Holiday Calendar 2023. The artwork they used is amazing and overall the calendar was fun to open. My only complaint is that I wish they had more snowflake icon cards. You will notice that some of the cards have snowflake icons on them which means that you can only get them with this calendar. First day was the Glaceon V card. I felt like this was a great card to start the calendar with. Day 2 was a booster pack. Here is the cards that were in the pack. Day 3 was probably my favorite and it is a Glaceon and Pikachu keychain. I wish the calendar had more items like this. Day 4 was this single card. Stantler is how I believe you say the name. Day 5 was another booster pack and these are the cards that I received. Now day 6 was a little different and I got my first 3 card pack in this calendar. These are the cards that I pulled. Day 7 was again another 3 card pack. Here are the cards that I received in that pack. Day 8 was another single card. This one is rare so I was really happy with that. Day 9 was a booster pack. A lot of psychic types in this one. Day 10 was a metallic coin. This is the Snome Pokemon and honestly Honestly, I don't know anything about this Pokemon. I wish it was a more well-known Pokemon, but I see they're trying to stick with the winter theme, which is why they chose this Pokemon. Day 11 was stickers, which these stickers are really cute. They have the Alolan Vulpix, Pikachu, the Snow Pokemon, and Delibird. Day 12 was a single Pikachu card. Day 13 was another booster pack. Day 14 was the three card pack, or they also called them a fun pack. Day 15 was another fun pack. Day 16 was a single card. Water type is my favorite, so I am happy with all these water type cards. Day 17 was a fun pack again. Day 18 was a Alohan Vulpix metallic coin, which I was happy with this one. This one is really cool. Day 19 was another fun pack. Day 20 was a single card, and this is the Snome Pokemon that was also on the first metallic coin. Day 21 was again another fun pack. Day 22 was the Alohan Vulpix V card, and this one is absolutely beautiful. So happy to have it in my collection. Day 23 was some more stickers. I really like the Glaceon and Pikachu sticker. Also a Happy Holidays sticker, which is really cute. Day 24 was a single card, and this is the Glaceon V Max card, and the artwork is amazing on this one. Day 25 was a booster pack, which I felt like this one was a weak way to end it. It should have been another special edition card, or maybe another cool item like the keychain. Overall, I thought the calendar was cool and definitely worth the money. Well, that was my overview of the Pokemon Holiday Calendar 2023. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and now I must be able to be in buzz away, and I hope to see you guys real soon. Bye!